it seems like we always end up in these whacked out situations. I don't know, maybe it's our karma. Like we did something bad in a past life? I mean really, really bad. Super villain holding the world to ransom destroying Tokyo kind of bad. Come to think of it, it's probably Raph's fault. Everything bad that happens to us is because of something bad Raph did in a past life. Oh well, no use crying over past lives. I guess we just gotta accept things as they are. And always be ready to kick some shell! Yeah! Shell for brains, can you keep it down? There are some people in New Jersey who are trying to sleep! <sighs> can't sleep either, huh? I'm too excited to sleep. I can't wait to have my own place again. I understand. I can still remember back when this used to be my room, when I wouldn't have to listen to my roommate snore like a chainsaw! Don't worry, I'll soon be out of here and you'll be back in your own room before you know it. Um, April? What are you doing with my Silver Sentry comics? Oh, I needed something to wrap my stuff in and these were just lying about, so I... Ah! Calm down, Mikey. I'm joking. I know better than to mess with a guy's comic. Oh, ha ha. Real funny, April. Enjoy your packing. Yep, moving out's looking pretty good. And for now, the police have two suspects in custody. Leo, Master Splinter, you two up? Shh. Meanwhile, in other news, an unexplained wave of gang activity is sweeping through the boroughs of New York. How long before they knock on your door? We'll have the full story when Channel 9 News returns. Sounds like Donnie's up, too. Boo! Ah! Whoa! Easy, partner, don't shoot! Mikey, never sneak up on a turtle while he's welding. Hey, love what you've done with the place. Yeah, go ahead. Make jokes, Mikey. But when I'm using this underwater access way to cruise the river in a submersible, you're gonna miss out on some fun. Unless you make yourself useful and help. <laughs> uh, suddenly I feel sleepy! <laughs> this cross brace will secure the access way and ensure its stability. So, you know what you're supposed to do, right? Yep, I'm supposed to swim in cold river water when I should be in a warm, cozy bed. Right. Chucklehead.
brothers, you guys aren't gonna believe this. So I was like, <laughs> and it was all, <laughs> and I'm like, <laughs> then it got all, <laughs> and then it was all roar, roar, Cuckoo, with claws, and crazy. I was like, claws. Hold up, guys. Raph, remember that albino croc we tangled with years ago? Mike's croc could actually exist. It does exist, and it's all, <laughs> and, <laughs> and, <laughs> and <laughs> We should have seen it coming, bro. You're one rib short of a barbecue. Look, I know what I saw. There's a huge, ugly reptile in the sewers. And for once, it's not you, Raph. And I'll prove it to you. I'm going back down there and find that thing. If you're serious, take this porpoise device. I made it to explore some of the underwater passageways. It's got a built-in camera and a transmitter. And I put a two-way radio in the mask. We'll be able to see and hear your mystery croc on here. If it exists. Stay tuned, guys, as Mikey TV takes you on a croc hunt! Mikey, you're not insane. Well, not completely. Check it out, guys! Big, dark, and scaly is living in our old lair! So right. The remaining component was exactly where you said. Now I can complete my task for you, and then you can aid me in completing mine as per our deal. I am so glad I made your acquaintance. I don't mind telling you, I've had quite a lot of experience repairing these units. Child's play, really, once you understand the basic principles. Well, what do you know? It's just a big crocodile version of Dawn. It is finished, my friend. Why don't you take it for a test drive? He's got an exoskeleton. I can't really see, but I think... I think he's talking to an Utrom. An, an Utrom? <laughs> an intruder. Okay, time to go. Stop. Now, and if I remember right, there should be an access cover just about here. <laughs> Guys, are you there? Mikey, where the shell are you? What's happening? I'm in the 39th Street runoff. It got a little hairy back there with my reptile pal, but I think I lost him. I didn't mean you any harm. 
Sometimes I get carried away. Look, guys, a handbag with claws. Guys, wait, it's... Mikey, but if this croc bites her head off, I don't want to hear any complaining. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Leatherhead. Leonardo. Raphael. Damatello. I'm Mikey. Come. It is so very drafty in these sewers. Let us return to my temporary laboratory where we can speak in relative comfort. Place like home. My sentiments exactly. Whoa! You're building a transmat? You are familiar with the transmat? Then you know of the Utroms. Actually, the Utroms and us go way back. Really? The Utroms are my family. It is a long story. It began when I was little more than a hatchling. I assumed that I began life as a mere exotic pet which for some cruel human reason was cast into the sewer. Fortunately, I was discovered not by humans, but by the Utrons, who deemed me worthy of further observation. During the course of this observation, I was accidentally exposed to a mutagen the Utrons had created. The mutagen not only changed my physical form, but greatly accelerated my intellectual development. And when the Utrons realized that I had become sentient, they adopted me. I was happy living with the Utrons. They taught me much. Life was good until the humans discovered our base and tried to destroy us. My family barely escaped. Once I finish building this transmat, I will be able to rejoin my family once again. Ah, my friend has returned. Gentlemen, allow me to introduce to you my good friend. Bastard stop me! Hardy har har. Leatherhead, my friend. Do you recall the traitors I told you about? It was these turtles who sabotaged the TCRI building. It was these turtles who destroyed the transmat. It was they who caused the Utrams to leave. Them? Yes, yes, them, them! Baxter Stockman telling lies? Imagine that! Them. These green gnomes are why I had you build our little you-know-what. And 
now we can put it to work. Donnie, what in the shell is that? I'm not sure, but it doesn't look good. exactly what we're gonna do before we do it. Somehow it programmed itself with our fighting styles, and its processors are working faster than our reflexes. So what do we do? Something unexpected. Can I borrow these for a second? Master Splinter always says we must train in every weapon form. It's time to put in a little practice. Playtime is over. You're so right. I am done playing. I'll be happy to finish you off personally. I can't count how many times you meddlesome freaks robbed me of my revenge when I was working for the Shredder. But this time, nothing will stop me. The Shredder? Huh? You worked for the Shredder? He was the Neutron's most hated enemy. You weren't intending to help me with the transmat. You used me. Very well. You pathetic freaks can all perish together. Believe me, I am doing evolution a big favor. Leatherhead, look out! Forget about this place! No. If I do not have the transmat, if I cannot be with the Ultrons, then life is meaningless. Leatherhead, please! Mikey, come on! Believe me. My friend. Michelangelo, move in! Leatherhead. Can you imagine being that alone? You know, things may get rough at times, but at least we have each other. Yeah, but do we have to have wrath? Huh? Come here, Knucklehead. 